Hello friends, welcome back. In this video tutorial, you are going to learn how to install Windows Server 2022 on Hyper-V on Windows 10. This video tutorial is presented by Search Inside Me powered by ITZOZ.com and you are watching this video on YouTube channel Peter Grise. This is a part 3 of this video series. So I'm going to start from where we have left in our previous video tutorial. You can find the link for the previous video in the video description. Now let's double click on the virtual machine which we have created in our previous video. Alright. Click on start to start the virtual machine. Press any key on your keyboard. So it will boot from the image file which we have previously attached on this virtual machine. Okay, so it's loading from the image file now. Once the loading is complete, the Microsoft Server Operating System setup will open. Here we have to select the language and the time and the currency format. So language is English, United States and the time and currency is India. Now click next, then click on install now. Here we have to select the operating system which we want to install. Now there are total 4 types of additions are available. The first one is the non-graphical interface addition in which you are going to get CMD command prompt and the PowerShell or you can manage it using the Windows Admin Center remotely. The second is with graphical interface. If you see the description. This option installs the full Windows graphical environment. This is a standard edition and we are going to click next now. Select the checkbox to accept the terms and conditions then click next. I'm going to select the second option and click next. Alright, so as you can see the operating system is now installing. I have fast forwarded the video. Normally it takes 5 to 10 minutes for the installation of the operating system. Once the installation is finished, click on restart now. Okay, it is rebooting and getting ready now. Now we are on customize setting window. Here we have to enter the administrative password. You can enter any password of your choice. Now Click on finish. Once everything is completed, click on connect and then we are going to enter the same password which we have entered just now and log in to the server. Okay. So there we are. This completes our this part of the video tutorial. Don't forget to watch our next video which will be very informative for you. Hello friends, thank you for watching our this video tutorial. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. This video tutorial is presented by Sajin Sami powered by itzoz.com and you are watching this video on YouTube channel Peter Kreis. 